mean, worth it. <laughs> Merry Christmas! <laughs> Merry, Merry Christmas, Merry Naomi! Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas! You guys. We are in a car. Oh, yes. <laughs> and doing a chat. We're gonna chat. And, and it's I'm, Christmas time. Yes, and I'm grateful for you. Hey, you guys, check out Naomi's. Look hey, at our sweaters. Hey, guys. She's a gift from heaven. Yes. And, and I am. You're a gingy. You're a gingerbread <laughs> man. I'm no gingy. I was looking at the sweater and I said, "This is Phil." Really? This is this is actually Phil, and not just because of the alarmed face, but <laughs> because. <Wait. laughs> am I always alarmed? No. Is this me? Is... No, but I mean, you're I usually like singing. More singing. That's your. That's I'm your writing singing. a song. Yes. But, but you're you know like. What? I think I kind of agree, and I'm not being silly. Okay. Thank you for choosing this for me, and you of look course. amazing. Um, You'll, you're safe with me, trust me. You driving? Won't. Yeah, sure. But like everything's gonna be okay. Okay. Um, I just wanted to worried. reassure you, you because don't have to do sometimes that. people get. I've a got a seatbelt on. <gasps> um, you're good. I was supposed to go the other way. Oh, but <laughs> oh, good. We'll see. So we got Christmas sweaters on. Yes, and it is Christmas time, and it's my the favorite time of the year. It really is. Wanna know? It's my favorite time of the year. I love Christmas. We want to know, Phil, what was a song that you and your family like listened to growing up? What was, I'm going to play it, if you tell well, me. Well, okay, listen to growing up. Okay, so there's there's favorites that I love to sing. Mm -hmm. There's favorites um, that give me like, it's like that cozy Nostalgia. vibe. Yep. Mm -hmm. And then there's like, just like, if I think of, when you said family, listen to growing up, I think the, the record that I heard the most and I still listen to the most is Nat King Cole. Um, Christmas and it's that it starts with the ooh, 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 just not frosty. it's just that it's that first song on the that Christmas record song. yes right, I don't know if it's it. even my fave I like it but it makes but you... it's just it's the first song on that record yep so I just I, if I think of my mom saying let's start some Christmas music it's let's open presents it's that it's that album right. I mean and it's just classic right Like first week of December. Okay. The tree. Yeah, pretty much us too. 
now we're like day after Thanksgiving is is kind like, of get started. The kids are just so pumped. It's like that is we get started the day after Thanksgiving. They want to last as long as possible. It is so fun to have kids. It during is. Christmas. It is. It's a whole. It brings. They it, keep it alive. Yes, because you know as you get older, it's like it kind of. It's almost sad how the magic is changes and fades before you have the kids again. Yeah. You're almost like man. it's you, you know, you just it, it's, you, you miss that that excitement, that anticipation, and the whole magic of it, and you, you start seeing like, oh, like that blow up Santa doesn't look as real as I thought it was, right, all that like, stuff. Do you have tricks to like? Are you like proactive? Like I'm gonna give, I'm gonna, I want a good, ex- I want that Christmas vibe. Generally, yes, I'm the type of person. I want my house decorated. So for fall, autumn, when autumn comes in, my house looks different. Oh, I start, yeah, I do an what autumn. Are some of the pe- like, do you put like something on? The, do you have a piece on the table yes i have because we have a few like spaces you do so like an I'll autumn make, wreath yes come autumn on wreath, i'm I proud do of you i love that pumpkins and acorns and oranges and golds and that that type of stuff um and berries um you do you know, like have like special berries. couch pillows no okay i don't do go that place far mats? yes okay i do a place do mat mugs? in my yep okay the whole nine and you only use those cups in autumn yes and, i love this and sometimes i would have guessed for some reason i knew you were that kind of person though. yes and so then when christmas comes it's like all right let's go and so we'll overhaul you know what has has become my like holiday this this begins my holiday is um i do it i do a turkey trot you know what a turkey trot is i've heard of this but i don't fully know okay it's oh. just like a like well i do the in, i live in encinitas california wait did you tell me about this probably um and you pay, and all the money goes to, uh, like in San Diego, it all goes uh, to like the to help the food shelter and provides meals for Thanksgiving. Mm-hmm. So it's a good thing. Um, but that has I've done it like seven, eight years in a row now, and uh, and I go and I run the 10K, and my friends will do it with me, and that's like for some reason that's become like I I, I get it. when you can buy the tickets in February, I buy them. I'm like so I'm all about the 10K. And because it, it like it's that starts the holidays for me because okay. I go and run at seven in the morning okay. with about eight thousand other people, and then and everybody's cheering and high fiving and everybody's getting medals and there's coffee flowing and donuts and there's people dressed up like turkeys and like Native Americans. <laughs> it's just amazing. And then um, and I see all my friends that morning. We talk about what we're thankful for, and then we go home and I'm home by like nine and then we put on the Macy's parade. Wow, okay. And that's like, that, okay, my holidays have started. I've been running, it's like my thing I do on the road now. It's mm-hmm. like my, my head's, and at home, it's like the one time I listen to like a podcast or get a, get any time kind of alone. To yourself. With, with yeah. kids. Mm-hmm. And, and so it's gone from a thing that like, wow, I hate this, but I feel like my brain <laughs> needs it. That was like five years. So like, this is the worst. Running is the worst. <laughs> <laughs> so like I actually enjoy it in a weird way out of like I don't okay I don't want to inflate the numbers I think it was about five to eight maybe six thousand people doing the 10k uh-huh I think I got 16th what yeah Phil. 16th out of like eight thousand people I ran it pretty <laughs> fast I mean there was there's like the pack that that like runs Mm-hmm. And they're all like finishing like 10 minutes ahead of me. Yeah. There's like, okay, you are the athletes. <laughs> but then there's like the dads who run every day. The dad bod guys. Yes. But like we run often and I'm in that pack. You know? I love this. But I'm the one at the back of that pack like trying so hard. If anybody doesn't, if you don't know me, like I'm a trier. I really like to try hard. You I'm are a three. A, like, yeah, you are, I was going to say a go hard, but that almost sounds bad. But no, like you are intense. I can't go not 10. Yes. <laughs> if I'm, I love if that. I'm going, it's going to be 10. So you're just committed. <laughs> I think you're you're going to go only. But what is that about? Is that like, is it because you want to know everything about what you're doing and like. I don't know what it is. Or is it like, I have to complete this. I have no. to finish this. I think it's like. Or you have to well, be it's, I, maybe I, maybe. <laughs> no, I just like, no, it has, actually has, it's not a competition thing. It, if anything, it's a competition with myself. Mm-hmm. But I think I just like to do, I like to feel like I did well. Like, I feel, okay. I like to feel like I didn't leave anything back. Okay. You, not, not for the sake of, accomplished. yeah, not for the sake of like proving anything to anybody. Um, maybe at one point it was, but it's not that anymore. And I'm, I'm like more talking about now, like as a songwriter even and as a musician. Right. Yeah. Like, 
It's just because I want to I want to get off the stage or I want to leave a recording session. I want to leave a writing session. I want to leave a hang. All that. I want to be done with the workout, feeling like man. I I just love the feeling of like I really. I think I did my best. Like I could do. Yeah. I I learned that about you that you are like all in. Your work ethic is amazing, and if I'm honest, I. I relate to that. I want to leave the space or leave whatever I do and know that I gave everything I could, not just in all of my energy, but more so in terms of like, this is what I wanted to do. Yeah, yeah. You know, yeah. and I'm I'm proud of what I was able to do, if that makes sense. Like, right. And it was authentic and it was real. And if yes. I can't do that, then I almost don't want to do it at all. Um, or I'll just feel bad for the rest of my life. Yeah. No. Um, but I think sometimes I will pull back if I feel like I won't be able to do it. Sometimes I won't even try, and that it's kind makes of me, me too. Sad a little bit. It's like there's certain like I've I've so many of my friends play golf, mm -hmm. and I've never played golf, and they always ask me if I everybody like, on no. the road, and and I think it's because like I like I and, and and there's a fear of being really bad at something. Yes. Like, I'm gonna be. And not, it, again, it's not because, like, it's not even a pride thing. It's just, like, I don't want to waste my time being right. really bad at something. Right. Like, what can I doing? just, can, I'll just go for a run instead by yes. myself. Because <laughs> I know I can at least put one foot in front of the other. And I'll get a good workout in. And no okay. one will know I did it. And it's fine. And okay. I'm, and and I'll least, finish 16th out of 8,000 people. And no one will know until now. Hello. And Hello. Ladies and gentlemen, 16th. Because... Now, when are you coming out with a Christmas record? Okay. Can I tell you the truth? What? It is my desire to do this. Do you have hesitancy about doing a Christmas I, thing? Yes, and I'll tell you why. Because I want to do... I want to do songs... I want to do very, like, Jesus songs, and I want to do traditional songs. Yes. I think there'll be a... I think there'll be um, think more grace that. for a Christmas thing. Really? I think so. Like, on my Christmas album, um, there's song. There's... It's mostly worshipful. Um... But there's also like a song, it's called The Christmas Waltz, and it talks about Santa being on the sleigh. There's a song I wrote for Mallory that's, uh, you know, uh, which I, it's, I got all I want this year for Christmas. Don't need no presents underneath the tree. Cause all I want every year for Christmas is waking up with you riding next to me. Aww. That's the chorus, you know? And people love it, and it's all part of the. I think there's just more, there's more, I think, I think it's like more a, wide open space. Okay. You know, you might be encouraging me to do this. I, I really do because that, that was, I had a little bit of like, are people going to just like be like, man, Phil, just keep it, keep it all worshipy, you know, and which I love, but keep it the worship songs and keep it about Jesus. I don't want to be boxed in or limited because I think God is in all the things and I'm not about to hit this car. And also the cool thing about, well, I am. yeah, everybody loves Jesus, the curve. Right, you know? <laughs> All right. You, are you doing a... I'm doing a um a thingy turn. What are these but, called again? Uh, a park. Parallel. Parallel, park. parallel parking. We're oh good God. drivers. One minute. I am, but I'm too close to this. One minute. No, you're good. Just keep going back straight. Straight. Ooh. Am I going to hit it? No, if you go... Go back a little more straight. And then turn. <laughs> yeah, you're good. Turn. Oh, yeah. It's... This is a, I'm used to a different car. You have a bigger car, don't yeah. you? Yeah. This is, isn't that big. I did it. Great. I don't know why I seem, I'm sounding accomplished well, I'm like so, I can't parallel park. I'm so excited for you to, to go down that road because your voice singing these songs that we, and one thing I, at least for me, especially like artists like you too, I mean a couple new Christmas songs or whatever would be amazing, but like to, for you not, which I don't think you would be, but I think some artists feel like the need to like create a lot of fresh Songs right, I don't, for Christmas, maybe one or two. Yeah, but you singing the traditionals, singing a couple cozies, just whatever your family I love loves. A cozy praise. Oh come on! Oh, by the way, I just thought of it. I've got an. If anybody wants to hear it, I've got a new Christmas song out now called "Behold." <laughs> Hello. You haven't even heard it yet. I haven't. I need to hear it. Uh, it's got like some. It's got like fresh lyrics on the chorus. Oh come, let us adore him. But new verses. Mm -hmm. And and it's it's a. Uh, I sang it with Ann Wilson's on it with me. He's a oh. sweetheart, uh, young artist, and she sounds amazing. So plug is that okay that's I just okay plug. let's do it i'm really excited about it and i think that 
But yeah, Joy of the World is awesome, right? Every year keeps coming. You'll keep giving us Christmas music. I think there won't be a year we won't get anything know. for Christmas. Maybe. I, I like putting them out. Yeah, and yeah. we like getting them, but okay. You're kind to say that. Speaking of gifts. Do we have a... I have a gift for you. I wish we had a guitar. Okay. What is this? I have a gift for you. What because it's Christmas. I hid it from you, and then when you went in the back seat, I was like, I didn't even, I did not see, see it. The gift. Do you want me to tell you why I'm getting you this gift before or after you open it? It's a small token, it's not anything. Else. Um, whichever one you think is, is better. You want me to open it first? Or you, you tell me first, tell me first. Okay. So, the name of it, of the thing that I got you, is Replica. And so, the gift I wanted to get a gift that that was a symbol, not just because we have stuff. We don't need more stuff, generally. But it's called replica, and it wasn't that you're a replica of anything. But I believe that the Lord is using you to replicate who He is in the mm -hmm. earth. And my hope and prayer is that people would see your drive and your passion, not just for. Um, and this is going to sound backwards, but I mean it this way. Not just for ministry and the and the things of God, because I think that's a that's a prerequisite. Like you have to have that, but also for music and like excellence. Mm. Like I, you could love God with all your heart, but if you don't have any character to go with that, what you do may not ever get done. If that makes sense. I think that you have such a heart for people, um, his, the Lord's church, mm -hmm. making songs that the church can sing, that people gathering, that they can literally lift up their souls, whether they're in their car or they're coming together. And my prayer is that that will be replicated through the earth. And so I got you this gift. Aw, well, I hope you are you making me want to cry it? a little bit, Naomi? This is amazing. Wait! Well, so, let's see. What do we got? Okay, is this is this a scent? Mm -hmm. Are you kidding me? Mm -hmm. Replica, reproduction of familiar scents and moments of varying locations and periods. Originally jazz club, Providence period, Brooklyn, twenty thirteen. Hello. This is a vibe, <laughs> Naomi. Thank I don't you. No, I don't fully know what it smells like. This I don't is, remember. That's what but I mean. this is like legit. Yeah. Thank you. It's sweet. I this hope is like you a cool. It. It's like useful, it's luxurious, it's wonderful. Man, yes. Christmas. And if you hate the smell, no. you can return it. But remember, it was uh, a symbol. It was, it was more about. It. That sounds. It's, look at, it, it smells like kind of manly. Yeah, like, it has I, like I'm a freshish, freshish yeah. kind of. Um, I don't know I won't how spray to. spray it in the, in the middle of your car, but I'm going to spray it out there. Okay. And it smells. Do you want me to spray it in here? It's, it's gonna be too crazy in here. No, yeah, I think it's gonna, I think it's a strong scent. But it smells so good. I hope that. Naomi, now that's listen, so Mallory, I'm you know because you got to be careful with women giving oh my other men fragrances and stuff. I'm careful, but there was a purpose. That's so it. awesome. Thank y'all. Thank you so much. Thank you.